Well, that's not very impressive. I mean, all of Wolfenstein is a bunch of mazes. Hello everyone, and welcome once again to Wolfenstein 3D, in episode 5 of 6. We're really coming down to the wire. Well, not really. There's still a little bit longer to go before I guess we get to the real wire, but even so. This is starting to get towards the end of the game, I should say. And even then it's just a prequel mission because I already killed the Fuhrer himself. It's basically just turning back the clock. We already know what's gonna happen. Blaskowitz is gonna get himself captured somehow. And then he'll somehow get out of it through even a more ass pulley method than the way he got captured. And then he'll kick the Fuhrer's arse. And save America! Not just America, but I guess Europe too. Because Europe was kind of having trouble from them as well. Save the world, Blaskowitz! Oi! It's funny. It's not so funny when they shoot me, but it is funny hearing them talk. Oh! What the? Better watch out. It's a trap. I can I can smell it. Ooh! Yes! Oh, I was hoping to get one of these bigger guns. Yeah, baby! You're screwed now, baby. Now I have the power of the blue shirt. I'm not sure if YouTube would be okay with me saying the double S's or not, but... You know, you gotta be paranoid about this kind of thing. It's norm normally the phrase is you have to err on the side of caution, but with YouTube, no, that's not good enough. You have to be straight up paranoid. Paranoid. Otherwise, you're, you'll die. Nice. Ooh, don't mind if I do have some apparently freshly cooked food. Yes, I'm going to assume that, that it just got freshly cooked right now. And then they're about to eat it off the ground. Because their superior forced them to eat it off the ground because their superior is a, is a prick. That's probably what happened, right? It's not like they were keeping it there and it got stale and cold. I refuse to believe that Blasco would, would sully his American stomach with some cold, stale food, so... Yeah. Sorry, Pooch. I have to do it. You left me no choice. Hey, if it were up to me, I'd throw you a bone, but... Since you're trying to break my bones... Nah, I'll just give you some lead instead. Oh crap. Not good. Well, okay. I guess, I guess that's cool, right? What the? That was a lot of ammo that I just burned through, but I don't even care. Because at least I didn't die. I'm getting very twitchy all of a sudden. Just like with YouTube, when it comes to Wolfenstein, you gotta be paranoid all the time, or you'll die. Well, YouTube won't kill you, but they'll kill your channel. That much is plain. It's easy to get lost if I don't pull up the map a lot. Because a lot of these areas look samey. Just saying. Good thing they're deaf. Don't worry, you'll find it in hell. Man, I'm not finding any secrets of any kind. I actually, actually starting to feel kind of bad about that. Like I should be looking for secrets. You know what, I'm just gonna go scavenge real quick. Whether I find secrets or not is another story, but hang tight real quick. Well, what do we have here? I actually did find a secret. Maybe it was worth it. Ooh, and it's a biggin'. It's a biggin' too. Quite a lot of ammo right there. Not to mention the treasure. The, the beautiful treasure. Although the biggest treasure of all is ammo and health, let's be real. That's the stuff that's actually practical, that you'll actually make use out of. Ah, okay, it's right up against the sun, of course that's not gonna be it. 
That'd be stupid to think that. Don't be stupid. Be like Blaskowitz. Not Machine Games Blaskowitz. This Blaskowitz. This Blaskowitz gets crap down. I mean, look at that. Look at that chiseled face. Does that look like a guy who's gonna run and hide? No. This looks like a guy who's looking around thinking, yeah, can't wait to find some patsies to stomp. Apparently there was another secret, but whatever. Think I care? What do I look like, a guy who cares? A guy who's not impatient? Oh boy. Oh boy. Hot diggity daffodil. What the? Hello. Well, you certainly are lame if you thought that would work. I'll tell you that much. Not to harp on that old joke, but if he thought that would work. Oh, he's lame, all right. Hey, buddy. Good to see you. You know, announcing your presence is not the smartest idea. Where's that guy? I know there was a guy in... Yep. I knew there was a freaking guy in here. It's got me on edge, you know? Let's see if I can find any secrets. Are you hiding any secrets in here? Probably not. Because it seems to be ordained that when I'm actually looking for secrets, they're never, they're never to be found. You know, unless I decide to come back later and check, then then it'll magically be there. This seems to be how it works. Hmm. What do I have here? Leon! Leon! Hello, Leon. I'm Blaskowitz. Nicely done. Well, that was quick. Yeesh. It's almost like I got really fortunate there. Oh, I see. What's here? I see. Interesting. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? Man, the secrets just conveniently happen to never be when I press them. Where I press them, I mean. I will be very fortunate if I find one. Well, I can at least find the optional areas that are pinned in plain sight. Sorry, Pooch. Again. Sorry. Oh, look! Hate Liar is a secret. Zafiora himself is a secret. It's a secret, everyone. Didn't you know that? The Fuhrer is a secret, even though he's plastered everywhere. <laughs> Who's he trying to hide? Who's he trying to hide from? I see. It's just a bathroom with healing supplies. And no trap of any kind. That was, uh, peculiar. Ah, right. It's because it's pressed right up against it. It would seem that it operates in these blocks, and it can't even have different textures on different sides of it. So, to some extent, they have to reuse it. Which makes it look a little silly when it's right up against it, and it's a completely different wall texture. It makes it look like there's a secret or something, you know? And not even, not even a well-hidden secret. You know what? Screw this. Whoa, holy crap. Whoa, 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 son. When I'm using a chain gun and I still get outmatched. Oh, crap. I haven't saved in a while, have I? Whoops. Hang tight again. Okay, I am back. I got my back my progress, which really wasn't hard at all. It doesn't take long to get through these levels, thankfully. And I'm ready to try again. I better get back on the saddle. Individually, they're not a big deal for my chain gun action. But the problem is there's too many of them. How the hell am I supposed to get through this? Damn. Problem. I have to hit and run. That's my only shot of survival. Kind of funny how I got an extra life when I'm about to lose it immediately. 
so it'll make it pretty much have been in vain. Damn it, I'm, at, I'm almost out of ammo too, completely. It's a real drain, you know? In more ways than one, man. In more ways than one. I'm guessing the prize isn't even that good. But I'll do it because my pride is on the line. What pride? There's some left in there. Probably. There, I killed all of them. And what's my prize? Whoa. More of them. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Lovely prize there. I mean, granted, at least I got some ammo back and some health back and some treasure. So that's always nice, but... Seriously, man? This is basically just bragging rights, isn't it, for the most part? And a little extra treasure. Not worth it. And yet I did it anyway, and I would do it again, probably. Because even if it's not worth it, I'll do it anyway. It's still fun. It's not boring. And that's good. Let's see if there's anything left to tap into. Okay, good. At least I can replenish my health to full. And there's a little bit of ammo left. Not bad. I'm not that bad, much worse for wear. So I don't have max ammo. Big whoop. Who cares? I mean, I pr I'm gonna pretend I don't care. That's look cool. What the? Oh, right. I, f I keep forgetting about this. Right, right. It's this way. Duh, it's the one that has the key door in it. Indeed, indubitably. It's time to exit. Well, at least I got a hundred, hundred percent kill ratio. Even if my treasure and secret hunting isn't exactly great, at least I know how to kill. I've got a bad feeling about this. My feeling was correct. How in the hell? That's what I thought. And then the second one killed. Then the second one gets a shot on me. Wow, good thing that one sucked at aiming. Seriously. Frick. This is bad. I think I hesitate too much to fire. Because I don't want to shoot too much and waste the ammo. Prick. Prick ass. I'm not looking so good. Ha! Nice. Jerks. Are you serious? Are you serious? Fine, to hell with this. I don't even care. I don't care about ammo conservation anymore. Damn it. But I do care about health preservation because if I die, well, it won't matter how much of anything I have done, would it? Okay, I better go into the corner here, I guess. Well, at least that'll keep the door open. That'll be convenient, won't it? Frick. Okay. Good. Excellent. I don't think so, pal. Not again. Now that I have the gift of hindsight, I'm unstoppable. Until I die. Then I will be very unstoppable. That will be very stoppable. Un-unstoppable. Non-unstoppable. Gotta get that joke in there somehow. Break. Mm. Don't mind if I have some of your hot meals that are perpetually hot and fresh. Like I said, I refuse to believe they're anything but hot, hot and piping. Screw you, man. Screw you. They're as hot and piping fresh as the lead in their bullets. And in mine, too. What do we have here? We only have one dead patsy. That's what we got. Ooh, nice. Nice room here. Now this is a secret room, baby. I'm not grabbing it, though. That'd be a waste. That'd be a huge waste. Of many things. Well, then. I take it the key is right here. Hey. 
No, it's somewhere. Maybe it shoved up one of their be on, be on. My, my, uh, uniforms. That's definitely what I was gonna say. Let's get out of here. Let's get the heffle out of here. Before anything else bad goes wrong. What the? Ah, okay. Very well. Well, that leads you right to the exit. Well, isn't that convenient? A little too convenient if you ask me. See, it freezes randomly. You can't explain that. Okay, I'll stop. Oh, seriously, that's kind of funny. At least I think so. I, I think so. Once again, I get half the secrets. And by half, I mean I got one and there were two. Hey, buddy. Good to see you guys. I was honestly kind of worried that you guys wouldn't make it. Even though you guys were in every other level, but hey, you never know. I might actually start to miss you. I'm missing you already. I really need to improve my aim. There we go. Didn't miss you that time. Okay, note to self. The door is right here. Silver door, I think. It looks like a brighter one, so I'm gonna go with silver. It's funny how the, the gold door is just a darker gray. While the actual silver key, when you pick it up, is basically the same color as the regular doors. As if it wasn't confusing enough. We gotta make things even more confusing somehow. Nice. Get another some practical stuff in here too. I kind of dislike rooms that are just treasured. Secret rooms that are just treasured. And especially ones that require you to work within it. Because that kind of sucks. Okay. I guess. I see. Okay, so that's a golden door. I am slowly weeding things out. Of course, there's two doors I haven't even entered yet. And they're nearly identical. Great. Nearly identical in structure. Man. Whoever made this level is running out of ideas. That's all I gotta say. Because how many of these same exact freaking corridors with the same exact enemies for the most part have been appearing? Oh, for crying out loud. There we go, finally. Some, no some change, a welcome change of pace around here. I say before I go into the exact same type of corridor. What is it with one of them with an SS guard and a dog and a and brown shirts and then other ones that are just the Leon white white shirts and some dogs and some brown Do you do anything original? Just saying. Wow, it's a good thing this one conveniently was the one with the silver key in it. <laughs> I mean, really. It's just so convenient, isn't it? It's almost contrived. Some might say. Okay, fair enough. So you only needed one of the keys to get to the exit. Because that's the golden door, right? And that's the silver door. So either one of them would have gotten you the victory, I guess. Weird. I just don't get it. I need to get some ammo, so uh, hang tight real quick. Whoop, whoop, what do you know? I found a secret. Isn't that lovely? And it happens to have ammo in it, too. So I found two secrets. Does that mean I get 100% this time? Or is there just gonna happen to be four secrets in this level? Because that would be funny. 
if there happen to be four secrets on this level just so it gets 50% again. Because I am destined for 50%. Half-assing it. Literally. But at least when it comes to killing, I whole-ass it. What do you know? There was actually four secrets. And I did find 50% again. It's almost like I saw into the future. Gotta love the music choices. Even though it is technically repeating a lot. But they're pretty interesting tracks. Gotta love the sadder version of the net of the Patsy anthem. Oh boy. This is not very good. Frick. Frick. Frick, 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 frick. Frick, 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 frick. Where are you? Well, at least you all lined up for me. I can appreciate that. Nicely done. Huh, funny. Okay then. Let's move on. Oh boy. I wonder if that was a different SS or if it was the same guy. It's the Patsy theme and it's sadder. I guess it's supposed to be a bummer this time. Frick. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Weird. I thought it would lead to an in interior. I was expecting a trap. Frick. Whoa, holy crap. I see they put... Th no, they did not put all their ducks in one row! That was a freaking... That was a freaking decoy! What the hell, man? Man, these patsies are getting nefarious. They're getting very devious, to say the least. I'm gonna have to get devi a little devious myself. Sorry, pooches. That's the way it's gotta go. Jerk. Just hiding in the corner there. Doing who knows what? With those dogs? Well, this works. I like the part where I don't get surrounded on all sides. Nicely done. <laughs> nice. That was awesome. I see. There's actually a lot of vantage points to get into that room. That really goes a long way towards making the game feel less linear. Now that is funny. A game that could literally do nothing but 90 degree blocks is less linear than many FPSs nowadays. What does that tell you? That says a lot, doesn't it? You can't blame it on system limitations. Because this game was made... This game is probably one of the first... Well, it's, it's at least the first mainstream first person shooter ever made. So, yeah. Can't say that against it. That's weird. Oh, this was the silver key. It's like it interchanged itself. There you go. Prick. Nicely done. Oh, okay, that was close. I'm actually getting my heart pounding a bit. It's a, bit, it's a bit, it makes me a bit on edge. You can't hear their presence. They don't, I mean, they, they announce themselves once and then after that, they're like complete assassins. You can't hear them until it's too late. What do we have here? A waste of time, that's what we have here. Ah, nope, not a waste of time. At least not anymore. Nice. 
<laughs> I just wanted to get it lined up like that. Huh. Secrets within secrets. What kind of madness is this? Ooh, a secret level! And this is one that I haven't been in before, or at least I don't remember being in before. Jackpot, baby! Jackpot! Jackpot! Wait a minute, I just realized something. It just occurred to me. I didn't get to the actual exit yet. Maybe I should do that first. You know, before I cross the final frontier. I want to see everything that this level has to offer. I see. Well, whoever Leon is, I hope... Hope he finds you in a pool of your own blood. I hope he spits on your corpse. Whoever this Leon is. Okay. I take it there aren't really any more secrets, or at least not around here. Yeah, I can go. Well, maybe I should do a bit of scavenging for a bit first. You know, so I can get my stuff up to 100. That might be nice, right? Or I can just, you know, find it in the secret area that I was literally just in. That works, too. Well, I found two-thirds of the secrets. That's, that's a step up. From 50%. This doesn't seem like a very... Aren't the secret levels supposed to be crazy? You know, like the one that's based on Pac-Man? What the? Einstavad! Ah, what do we have here? Ah, what do we have here, mate? Oh, crap. That was not good. Ah, crap. Even worse. I really need to get on the ball with that. I know he technically gives you a warning, but that's like a couple of frames, maybe? My, my reaction time is not very fast. Especially when I can't see them coming. Well, letting them come to me gives me plenty of reaction time. Maybe I should look towards the direction I'm going towards. Towards the opening. I should look towards the opening. So that I don't get caught off guard. Nearly so easily. Okay, it's just a lot of mazes. It'd be funny if it had the Pac-Man ghost in it, but it doesn't. I see. You know, it just occurred to me that the ceiling is blood red. It's kind of interesting. Has it always been like that? I can't tell. That's what I thought, buddy. Up yours too, buddy. Oh boy. Take that, you prick. Nicely done. I'm on, a, I'm on a roll here, and I don't want to screw it up now. Why'd you walk away? Are you an idiot? Or a genius? I can't tell. Yeah, their AI is way too simplistic to be a genius. It's just that, for some reason, he randomly decided to move forward. Both times. I don't know, for some reason, his AI is compelling him to move that way. Ah, for frick's sake. It's like even when I see them, my body doesn't want to move fast enough. It's like watching... It's like being in a boxing ring and, uh... You're about to get a punch swung at you. Everything just seems to go in slow motion. Actually, I'm pretty sure that's throughout all of a boxing match if you're actually focused. Douchebag, you were trying... You were hoping to trap me, weren't you? Well, not on purpose. Because you're incapable of it. But you were trying to conveniently make me trap myself. If that even makes any sense. So, this is the level stick, huh? It's just a bunch of mazes. Well, that's not very impressive. I mean, all of Wolfenstein is a bunch of mazes. What do you have to offer that the other levels don't? 
what makes this stand out from a diff from a normal level of Wolfenstein 3D? Other than being even more maze-like than usual, which isn't a virtue. It's kind of annoying, actually. I can't even find a key anywhere. Seriously. Where's the end of this thing? Even with the auto map, I can't tell what's what. Wait a minute. What's in there? Huh. Okay. Well, I found a key. Thank goodness. I guess I may as well check to see if there are any secrets around here. While I'm in the while I'm in the area. Unfortunately, it's just occurred to me that I'm running out of time, so I'm just going to just hump the walls as I give my outro. That is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like mazes upon mazes upon mazes upon mazes. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and very pleasant day. A beefy pleasant day. See you later. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.